Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Lock security feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP Lock for Factory Reset Protection. Now, here with us today, we have a Samsung Galaxy A11 that is originally from Track Phone or Straight Talk here in the U.S. And this is a device that does indeed have the Google Account Lock enabled because as we can see here, as we're going through the setup steps, we get to the screen that tells us that the phone was factory reset, and to continue, we have to either verify the previous pattern screen lock that was used, or if we tap on use my Google account instead, it'll pull up the secondary option that tells us that we can also sign in with a Google account that was previously on the device. So we've been contacted by tons of customers over the years asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific model. And so we're now making a video to show any interested customers that we do indeed offer a service to be able to get the lock removed from this exact model without having to have the previous user's information. The process that we do to remove the lock is done directly to the device while it's plugged into a computer. And the great thing about this is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone, anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You would just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection and we can remotely connect right to your computer through the internet to perform the exact same process that we did here with this one. So actually before starting the video, we, ha we had already done 99% of the work necessary to remove the lock just so we can keep the video as short as possible. So now we just have the last step to go through, which you guys will see here. The device is clearly on the lock screen. I'm just going to back up one step here to Wi-Fi, and then I'm going to go ahead and go forward again and hit next. That's going to ask us about copying any apps and data, which we don't need. And you'll now notice that the message has changed. So instead of it asking for the previous Google account that was on it, it's now prompting us that we can sign in with any Google account or even create a brand new one if we want. We don't need an account here, though. We're just going to go ahead and skip through all the rest of the setup steps just to make sure that we can get all the way to the home screen and therefore be able to use the phone as normal. We don't need any of this extra stuff, so we're just gonna go skip, 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 skip. Don't need any other apps, no, thank you. Don't need a Samsung account either. Uh, we'll just turn those off and keep going. There we go. So now when we tap on finish down there, we should see that we have the device's main homepage loading up with full access to all of the apps and settings and features. And this is just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. While we're here, we're going to pop into the settings just to verify exactly what we are working with. So when we go into the settings and then down to the bottom to the about phone section, we can indeed see that we have a Galaxy A11 and then that model number there, the SMS115DL, that's the model number of the straight talk or track phone variant of the Galaxy A11. So if you have one of these A11s with the Google Lock enabled and need help getting it removed, we would love to assist you with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact info will be found right down in the video description. And we'll also put a slide at the end of the video that has all of our details there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have on our channel, as we offer a lot of different services for thousands of models of mobile devices. And I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. 
Hitting that subscribe button while you're there will enable you to be notified of all of the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like we're doing here with this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes también nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.